First, open up the box and inside you'll find the product information and the installation CD. Followed by the main event, the DCS942L network camera, but more on that later. A blue ethernet cable and the power adapter. Now let's take a closer look at the device. On the front, a mic, IR LEDs, a camera lens, and a passive infrared sensor for better motion detection. On the back, an ethernet port, a headphone or speaker jack, power. And down below, the WPS button, LED, reset button, and the power LED. Now grab the installation CD and head over to your computer. Insert the CD and the setup will automatically begin. Follow the prompts while the installation CD prepares your computer for setup. If your router supports WPS or Wi-Fi protected setup, like most D-Link routers do, setup is going to be a breeze because WPS makes it easy for your devices to connect to your wireless network without having to connect the device to your network with an ethernet cable or having to remember your wireless password. But if your router doesn't, we'll cover that setup too in just a moment. For WPS, plug in and connect the power to your camera wherever you want it set up. The camera is ready when you hear it click and the blue LED flashes once. Then, press and hold the WPS button on the back for 3 seconds or so until the blue LEDs begin to blink. Now head over to your WPS enabled router and press the WPS button on it within 60 seconds and the DCS942L will automatically create a wireless connection to your router. You'll see the green LED on the back of the camera when it's connected. Now head back to your computer and complete the setup. Select yes, my router has a WPS button and hit next. Follow along the prompt until you're asked to select the new camera, if you have more than one, and click on next to continue. Create a new admin password for your device and continue until you're prompted for your My D-Link account information. But before we move on, here's how to set up the DCS942L without WPS. Now if your router doesn't support WPS, start by connecting the included Ethernet cable to the DCS942L and the other end to an available LAN port on your router. Connect the power, and then go back to setup on your computer. This time, select no, my router does not have a WPS button, and click next. Follow the prompts and select your new DCS942L network camera when asked. Hit next and create a new admin password for your device. Select wired if you want to keep your camera always plugged in directly to your router, or most likely select wireless to give you greater flexibility as to where you put the camera. And now setup will scan for available wireless signals in your area. Select yours, and if your wireless is secure as it should be, enter your wireless key below. And then when asked, unplug the ethernet cable and give the device a minute to restart, but we'll skip ahead. Now that your network camera is connected by WPS or the standard installation method, you need to enter your MyDLink account information. If you don't already have one, no problem. With an email address, password, and your name, you can quickly create one. But for now, we'll assume that you have one. Enter your information, and in a moment, your new DCS942L camera will be added to your MyDLink account, along with any other MyDLink enabled cameras for you to keep an eye on your house, kids, or pets when away from your computer or mobile device. Click Finish, and Setup will add a shortcut onto your desktop to make it even easier to access whenever or wherever.